Well hello guys and welcome back to the channel. Today I'm giving the Fiesta a quick wash before I get on with some of the more fiddly, tricky and more highly skilled parts of assembling the Fiesta RS style spoiler. So today I'm checking out um, the clearances to the end plates and the lower spoiler when I open and close the boot. Uh, make sure there's no problems there so you could use the car as normal once this is fitted on. I've then been focusing my attention on engineering interfaces, 3D printing some buckets uh, for fasteners, cutting those in, fitting them, making them smooth, uh, using expanding foam and some Gorilla Glue here to make it all uh, one part. You can see roughly what that will look like. Smoothed in, sanded, looking fantastic. And then a quick trial with some bolts um, to make sure they all fit the holes. So this is what it looks like at the moment. It's clearly not a finished part, but it's had a quick coat of resin to try and uh, harmonize the look and I'm getting the end plate fitting just right. So the idea here is you line it up, um, take an outline around the part, mark up where the bolt holes are, and then to try and transfer that into the 3D computer world. I've also been investing a lot of time behind the scenes in getting the rebating of the fasteners right, uh, thinking about how I'm gonna connect the upper and lower spoilers together so this thing can be dismantled into its component parts. You can paint them, you can install them any way you like. So here we go. The intention here is to try and trim down the trailing edge um, and then make some little recesses, improve the hole positions uh, on the upper and lower spoiler, put a little rebate in so it all looks nice and flush when it's assembled uh, and give a little bit of room for some tiger seal if you're wanting to make it a more permanent connection. So here it is modelled up, you can see those three fastener holes and I've spent a lot of time, hours in fact, perfecting the shape of the surfaces to make it look as OEM as possible. So here's the printed part uh, for the left hand side of the spoiler haven't quite finished weeding out all the uh, build supports from the 3D printer, but it gives you an idea. Um, so obviously that's now a slightly more uh, refined part. We've got a nice trailing edge, which looks a lot less slabby than the one we had before. And a quick side-by-side -side of those two bits, I hope you'll agree, um, that looks a lot nicer um, as a finished part. And the wonderful thing is all I have to do is click a button to mirror it, and I've got one for the right-hand side. So let's go and fit it all together. Getting excited now. So uh, the end plate with a bit of double-sided sticky to make sure it lines up, poking through some uh, M6 stainless bolts and using those holes. Just listen for the click, it's so satisfying. Et voila, the two parts are joined. So I've done that on both sides of the spoiler and that sort of sets the slot gap between the two elements on the wing. And there it is, when it's uh, assembled with hopes and dreams and some sticky tape, this is still a prototype and I'm having some issues again with the uh, chemical reactions going on with the paint on the top spoiler so I'll be using a different paint system later before I take moulds but it gives you a feeling for what the thing is going to look like when it comes together. Now it wouldn't be a engineer video without a quick trial fit so here it is on the back of the car looking mean. Um, it's in keeping I would say with the styling of the rest of the car. Uh, it's got the RS sort of style end plates with that rear flick at the trailing edge and uh, you can really see it adds a lot of height, a lot of aggression, hopefully slightly improved airflow over the back of the car as well. So looking rather pleased with myself. <laughs> it's been a lot of fun, a lot of hard work to get to this point, and there I am hiding behind the spoiler. Thanks very much guys for watching. Um, if you've been enjoying, please subscribe and follow along for the rest of the story with the spoiler. But for now, engineer out. Yeah.